the swim. You better learn quick, Jim. Okay, in this video, I'm going to be doing a tutorial on how I paint my concrete statues. So, here's some statues that I've made. Some of them are painted, some of them are unpainted. Alright, so we have this guy here, he's gold. Today we're going to be painting the statues like this one. So it's going to be a black undercoat with a gold brushing over top. So the ones I'm going to be painting are this one, this one. This one's already painted, but the gold we're going to be doing is going to be a different gold than this. And I might paint one of the Buddha heads. So I'm going to paint three statues today. So what we're going to do is we're going to just get some cheap paint from the dollar store. This is a couple bucks. It's a regular acrylic paint, it's black, and this is what we're gonna do the base coat with. So we're just gonna pour some in. This doesn't have to be precise. You can do one part paint to about 10 parts water. That's about good. And then we'll take a big paintbrush like this. We'll stir that up and then we're just going to paint one coat of that on. Okay, we'll start from the top. And then you want to take your brush like this and just kind of dab it and make sure you get all the little spots. statues painted all black with the black wash and I did this guy a little bit lighter because I wanted to see the difference of how he turns out after we do the gold brushing and you can fine-tune the paint you can water it down as much as you want so we're gonna let these dry um, the Sun's kind of gone down so it's gonna take a little bit longer but normally if you do this out in the Sun this will dry in five or ten minutes but hopefully in about 20 minutes these will be all dry and then we're gonna do the gold brush over top Okay, the black undercoat paint is all dry. So we're gonna take some of this gold paint. This is just from the dollar store. And then we're just gonna put a little bit on a piece of paper or cardboard or something. <laughs> and we're gonna take a small paintbrush like this. And we just wanna get a little bit on the tip. And then we're just gonna lightly brush it like this. So I got this one all done here too and this one had a darker undercoat and so we're gonna let that dry for 15 minutes and then we're gonna spray paint this with a clear acrylic and then it'll be good to go outside so the paints dry so we're gonna take our clear coat semi gloss now you don't want to use a matte you want to use at least a semi gloss or a regular gloss the matte can make the color look bad for some reason sometimes <laughs> Okay, so uh, one of the reasons I like to paint my statues, it gives me more of a variety of statues to sell. Some people like them painted, some people don't. Um, one of the nice things about painting statues is you can charge more. So normally I charge $60 for this one, but with it being chip painted, um, I can charge, you know, maybe $70, $70, $80 for this one. And it only takes about 10 minutes to paint. so. Nice little way to make a little bit of extra money. All right, so I got all my statues painted here. So here's a before and after. 
then if you can remember this guy here I did a lighter undercoat and I did a little bit more gold just to show you the difference 